What is up, guys? Joe Holland here. I am here with Donnie Johnston. We are going to make a Brandon box for the Otter Large Pro Sled. I already have one made, but I got so many requests on how to make one of these that I decided just to make another one. So sheet of plywood, this is 3 8 It's a 4 by 8 sheet of plywood. Donnie's going to measure this and split it up into thirds, which is 16 inches each. 16, yeah. So he's going to... I got them marked out. We're going to snap a line. So you hold that in. All set? Yep. All right. Beautiful. All right, the hardest part right here is marking for the inclines of the sled. So we're gonna push in with my knee on the outside. So I'm flat. Donnie's gonna lower his down as much as he can. Right there, I would say. Yep, and I'm sitting on mine flat here. He's going to mark that incline. He's going to put a nice little mark on that the whole way. Okay, there's one. All right, we'll, we'll fit it. See if we have to make any adjustments. How does that look? Looks good on the back here. Pretty good. Um, that'd be the tightest spot right there. Yeah, that'd be perfect there. Boy, that, that is really, really close here. Close enough? I think so. I mean, that's yep. That, that's really close. Yep. It's nice tight fit here too. Yeah. Yeah. That's great. Okay. What we have here, guys. I'm just leaving these in here from last time. Is this is a two by two? It was a two by four. I ripped in half, and then the other half's underneath. And these are just screwed together, kind of sandwiched, and that gives you something to screw into the sideways. Beautiful. Nice. Okay, that'll temporarily hold it till we get the end pieces.
the best two to put up here and uh, cut a couple blocks. Those are the best two. Donnie's going to cut the upright corner pieces now that are going to catch screws from both directions and strengthen the whole box. Want me to cut that knot out or is that not? No, that's all right. I should be right about there. there, yeah. 42 and 3 quarters. Okay. Forty-two and three quarters. The other was forty-one and a half, right? Uh I thought it was just forty-one. Ah. <laughs> uh, the Hard to really tell. I would say right about there. 41. 41. We'll try it. Yeah. You good there? Yeah. Alright, get the screw gun. Okay, got that side marked. Seems like it's pushing it out. Uh, try try oh, for that. Okay. Yeah, try it right there, yeah. Uh top's gotta come right there. Does that look alright? Yeah, the bottom's good. Okay. So that's the front ones. Placeholder. Now, what's yours look like over there? I think it looks good. There's not much for air. Yeah, that looks about the same. Yeah. Oh, we'll mark this out. Cut the sides. Okay. Yeah. Right there. Mm -hmm. Can you kick it in? There you go. Yeah. Okay. 
it. This is a... Should be free, I think. Yeah, this back's going to be perfect. You want me to push that in for yeah. you? Yep. Nice. Beautiful. Okay, I could always come back and and pocket one in there with a the longer yeah, one. Yeah, that'll be one in there, but yeah. longer ones here. Okay. So the oh, you're just gonna do a couple. Just I'm to, just gonna hold it so you get the longer. I think the longer ones would stiffen this better. Yeah, for sure. Oh, I hate that. The lamb. Oh, laminated. And delaminated. Yeah, I'll probably sand that right off. Put a little glue in there and yeah. clamp it back. Okay. The measurements of the box on this, I guess this is the largest sled that you can purchase. Yeah, the, the Otter Pro large. Yeah. The width is 41 and a half inches outside to outside. And the length Is 83. 83. What did we add for an upright? Uh, on the on the front of it, it's a little bit different on the width. Now it's 43 and a quarter on the width on the front. What and was on it on the back? The... It was. Well, that's the front. Well, that's the front. Yeah. Okay. On the on the front, it's 41 and a half. What was it on the back? 43 and a. And a on the back it's 43 and a quarter awesome and then what we add for height back here was it a true 14 uh very uh 14 three quarters yeah and then here it'd be 16 right 16 it's the full on thing the in the sides middle. and then we uh traced the angles on the on the two ends so it was good and tight good and tight down here fits beautifully Dry it out before you paint it. All right, looks good. Well, that's it, guys. That's how you build it at home. It was uh, two two by fours and one sheet of three eighths plywood. Is all it is. And Donnie and I are gonna we're gonna pick up a can of paint. I'm gonna sand the top and sand everything smooth so we don't get no splinters. Yeah, knock the edges off because plywood has a tendency to be pretty splintery if you don't round the round, yeah. round the edges and. 
I'll hit all the edges and we'll get, we'll let this warm up and dry out in here with the fire. And then we're gonna uh, throw a coat of paint on there. Donnie said I ought to put Joe Holland fishing, maybe a YouTube logo on there. What do you guys oh, think? You definitely should. All right. Yeah, you definitely should. Donnie says do it. Leave it in the comments what, what you think I should put on there, guys. Glove? Oh wait, we got no, it backwards. backwards. <laughs> Not quite Not like a glove. Like OJ's glove. <laughs> that wouldn't fit. Like a glove. <laughs> Wonderful. Nice. Alright. And then all we're gonna do is just screw into those cleats that we have already fasten to the to the plastic sled pull it in yeah I think I hit three in that <laughs> good yeah so we're gonna put washers in front of those screws so it doesn't suck in through the wood Well, we just got a two inch screw there. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah. Well, that was, it was a little uh, more challenging than I thought it would be, you know, when we were making it because of the scribing you had to do on the side pieces is pretty impossible with one guy. I mean, you can do it, but uh, having two people involved really helped out there, but uh, it went pretty well, so, and it came out nice. I think this 2x4 up top stiffens it yeah, tremendously. Yeah. I don't think we needed them on the back. Big, yeah. big plus having that. If we had to, we could add one here pretty easy. Right. But yeah. But I don't see any need of it on, you know, quite, well, there's some give to it, but. Yeah. You know. Thanks for tuning in. Hope that helps you. Hope you guys build a box for yourself. <laughs>